That's the time. Yep. And it's my birthday as well. I have to get up now, apparently. Because I've been told to. Just five more minutes. Hello YouTube, how do you do? My name is Monkey, and this is my vloggy. A little bit hungover still, but I had to get up early this morning. As you saw before, it is like nearly 5 o'clock and I'm awake. I don't know what for, uh, but I do know that it is to do something with my birthday. My brain isn't working properly right now. But yeah, so I'm going to film the whole day because I don't know what's going to happen and I kind of want to remember this. This is my breakfast this morning. Yeah, pancakes and bacon. just found out the reason I got up so early and the reason that I'm this tired and feeling this groggy and hungover and sick is because I'm going to London. The fantastic Penelope over here is taking me to London for my birthday. So you get a day out with Monka in London. Yeah. We're in Exeter. Very tired. Very tired. We've still got four hours till London. So I've been asleep. Look at this weird thing. Look at that! Weird. I woke up in this daylight. Which is good. But I'm very, very groggy now. Do you have that? Yeah. Fuel of the monk here. We're in London. I've got such a numb bum that I can't walk properly. I feel like I've got one leg. It's insane. So where are we gonna go? We need to go get some food. So we're gonna go get some food. We're gonna go find somewhere to eat, like the salsa. The salsa? Sounds good. This is really weird. Um, I've never been in a crowd so big just to see one place before. It's weird. I'm at the Buckingham Palace. I've never seen Buckingham Palace in person before. It's very cool. You've probably seen it before. You probably know what it is. But yeah, it's awesome. So it's, uh, it's one of those spectacular places that you don't get to see every day. Unless you live in London, then you're just lucky. I wouldn't want to live in London, it just seems too busy. There's too much going on. But yeah, I really wanted the, uh, you know, the guard people, those people. Like, I don't know if you can see them. Uh, we've got a bunch in the crowd here. Those guys. That guy. I wanted him to be out here because I really wanted to just like go up to him and be like, yo, I'm a monkey. Do you want to be in my vlog here? Are you enjoying the view of the building? No, I'm enjoying the little man walking up and down. What does he do all day? Walks up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. I'm worried she's going to get lost in London. It's fine, we figured it out. I'm scared. I'm riding the underground. I've never rode the underground before. It's amazing. I'm gonna go tickets to say it's my birthday. Escalators. This is what art is. We're in the modern art gallery, the Tate Modern. Um, it's pretty cool. What is that? Art is an expression of oneself. This piece makes you want to touch it. Um, not touch shit, but hey, <laughs> it looks like shit. <laughs> we title this piece, How to Poo. This, this piece of work is entitled John Cage. Because my birthday's on the six. Today's the six. And I found them six times in my former work.
having a very good birthday. It's an awesome birthday. Well, we've been to Buckingham Palace. Uh, we've been to the Tate Modern. Uh, now we're gonna go try and find a coffee. Because we wanna get a coffee. Oh yeah, we might go check out Shakespeare's Globe. We don't know yet. Depends. But yeah, it's going good. We're having a good time. Are you having a good time? Uh, see this music, this music was all put on for me. Because uh, I come to London very few times. You know, I don't come very often. But when I do show up, they have a party for me. If you ever been to the Natural History Museum? You really should. It's freaking awesome. Charles Darwin. Darwin. Check it out, man. Just chilling. Charles Darwin. Um, so yeah, we're gonna look around the Natural History Museum and see what it's about. There's freaking monkeys here. Monkey. Hey, do you wanna see a monkey? La 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 la. Check it out, man. They're everywhere. Wanna see this? Boom. What is it? It's the Look at it, there's a girl who wrote a book, everyone that they died out because uh -huh. the, they got their heads were too big for the one, so they died up because wherever they lived they passed on to their kids so their heads got their brains got bigger and bigger and bigger until they just could girls couldn't give birth to them anymore that's why they all died up. You know you, you look at this guy and you think why isn't he still around? Do you know what I mean? Did you know that Charles Darwin had seven children and he also he was a Christian? Yeah if you don't know who Darwin is you're a dumbass. But he came up with evolution, the theory of evolution, didn't come up with it, so that was God, apparently. If he was a Christian and he came up with evolution, that's completely like blowing his faith right out of the water. Mental. My name is Penguin. I'm the first one. First one ever. This is always good to show people. Dead birds. Darwin's pigeons. Darwin's actual pigeons. Selection isn't healthy as true. If you didn't hear that, she said that <coughs> pigeons help prove what? Okay, pigeons? Define species, because pigeons can come all shapes and species. You can breed them to look anything you like. You can breed them to have furry feet. And it proves that a species is a lot broader than it is specific. Shit, you don't know. Big ass, gigantic, not as big as my cock, dinosaur. <laughs> that is one scary, scary freaking thing. Is that good about zooming? What? I don't even know what you're zooming. Oh. Yeah, yeah. This is this is the best thing about this. What? Check it out, man. Monkeys everywhere. Yeah! Baby, baby, baby. Hey, hey. Question for you. If there was a movie of Charles Darwin, who would you want to play Charles Darwin? Mine, uh, suggestion, is Sean Connery. Just because they look the same. Pretty much brothers. And you know, Sean Connery's at the right age now. Post in the comments and tell me what you think would be the best. Uh, person, actor, or actress to play Charles Darwin. Don't want to be sexist here, you know? The tiger. You know what they should also do? They should make a, uh, should make a Lion King sequel that's called A Tiger King. It's obvious. I have horns coming out of my head. It's a turtle. You know. Don't freak out. So, freak out. That's a snap turtle. It's got a big fucking mouth for all that cock. Oh my god, snakes. Oh my god, they're everywhere. So, what are you afraid of, Mikey? Mm -hmm. Oh, what are you having a paddy about? Oh yeah, would it be something like... Oh, uh, that. 
I'm not looking at him. Come on, look at it. No. Look at what happened if it was like Harry Potter and the ship disappears? Seriously. I'm going to make you edit this later and I'm going to look at the snake. <laughs> anyway, maybe not. <laughs> Check it out. It's a crocodile. Freaking crocodiles are cool. So much better than snakes. God, I love. What? Holy shit, look at that. It's a fish in a fish. It's a fish in a fish. Hello. I got something to show you. Pretty incredible. I'm gonna put you up my nose. Right, look at this. This is the start of the squid. <laughs> 20, roughly. I'm not saying it was accurate, but that squid. 27 feet. It's pretty impressive. I got, I got some advice for you, YouTube. Don't come to London if you're colorblind, because they use color everywhere. Everything is color coded. I mean, everywhere. <laughs> We're in America. Well, you're in London. Go on, sir. Whoa. This is not the biggest mammal in the world. Definitely the heaviest, but it's not the biggest. The biggest is a squid. I suppose you can't say biggest. You want to say longest. Did you know the whales used to be land animals as well? They went from land to shallow water. Obviously they needed to develop flippers uh, to swim. Um, and then they went from shallow water to deep water and then they went to really deep water and lost their legs. Uh, you can tell this by the bones on below their tails. So if we zoom in on that bit, these bones here, they are all uh, fragmentations of leg bones. Evolution. Evolution, Darwin. Evolution. Yeah. Pretty freaking cool place, this place. I recommend you come here and have some fun. It's uh, one of those places where you can get lost in here for a day. It's really good. However, we are getting hungry, right? And uh, we want to go get some food. My treat. Anything you want. There's one thing I didn't see while I was in London. That's uh, any freaking London YouTubers. Where are you all? Where do you hide? I'd love to have run into one of you. <laughs> Me and Nell went for food. This is what happened. We're lost. lost. We're abandoned. We don't know where we are. We don't know where to go. We don't know how to get there. I might not make it back. God, I'm so hungry. The Greg's tempting me as well. So, uh, now, where are we? London. <laughs> What's in London now? People. Pizza. People. People. You know what else is in uh, London? British Broadcasting Community. <laughs> yeah. 
I've never seen it in real life. Uh, I'm, I'm quite impressed Look because. Here on the front. Like yeah. You want to know something else though now? Yeah. That over there, this bit of road, uh, Richmond Hammonds. Mm -hmm. Richard Hammond. Oh, from Cup. Cup, yeah. Jeremy Buffett. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, yeah. Ha! I did it, found it. I know where it is now. I'm gonna fucking rob the place. <laughs> Somebody give me a job as a presenter and I won't. That's, that's the bet. I'm not pulling you into I just wanna talk and walk, man. Jesus Christ. So I'm in uh, Westfield Shopping Center. This is like the biggest shopping center in Europe. And I'm like, totally gobsmacked at the size of this place. It's amazing. They have everything here. Everything. It's very cool. You should definitely come here if you come to London. Yeah, I don't know why I'm, I'm recommending places, but uh, it's, it's what we do. Can you see Nell in the background? Like she's pointing. What are you pointing at? Oh, holy crap, look at that, that's amazing. Imagine if it fell through the roof and killed us all. Have you ever seen something look so tasty? Oh, so we just had like the best meal I've had just in a long time. It was Manic Dippy. It was great. Um, yeah, we are now going to go to the bus and we're going to trek back to Plymouth. So, literally had a great day today. This has been my birthday. I hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you, thank you so much for coming along with me. Not that you had any choice. But uh, yeah, thanks very much. I will see you tomorrow, hopefully. Um, it depends. I don't know. It, it does, I don't know. But uh, yeah, thank you. Thank you very much for watching. I've been a monkey, this has been my vlog eh? Your nose, I'm gonna close this vlog with my nose because that's the way a monkey rolls. I will see you all tomorrow. Peace out, take care, bye bye.